Welcome to Selmac Machinery's Knowledge Base. Today we'd like to discuss crowning. There are three types. There are hand operated with Allen key, there are hand operated with digital readout, and there are motorized, which is controlled completely by the control. Today I'd like to explain the manual with Allen key. Okay, we're going to make a fold in a piece of material and then see if the material is the same angle in the middle as it is at the ends. Crowning, if you measure this end and it measured 90 degrees, and you measured this end and it measured 90 degrees, and then you measured the middle with the protractor and it was two degrees under, you can bring that two degrees back up by adjusting the centre ones of these wedges. By tightening them, you will bring the bottom bed up. By loosening them, you will take the bottom bed down. Bit of a, an exaggerated crown effect, that. Um, you just do a little bit on the first one, a little bit more on the next one, a little bit more on the middle one, and the same on the left. And then tweak them, make a fold, check the fold until eventually the fold comes out straight. Before, this would have been underfolded, but after the adjustment, everything becomes parallel. The adjustment is made, basically, the wedge goes in like that, or the wedge comes out like that. So, little adjustments at a time, um, along with several of them, until eventually you make another fold and check they are correct. Okay, we also have a means of crowning and uh, adjustment on the top distance piece. Basically, you undo the 8mm pin, you take a, a brass bar or an aluminium bar and you tap the top wedge to the, from the right hand side to the left, which will bring down that distance piece. You put a little bit on the uh, first one, a little bit more on the next, a little bit more on the next, creating a, a camber as well also there. So that is the means of adjustment on the top distance pieces. 